Hi everybody, it's Corbin, and in today's video, I actually have shot this once before. I really had it planned out. It was really gorgeous and pretty, sort of, and then reality set in, and I got sidetracked, and I got lazy, and I kind of decided to do other things and do running around and really just become avoiding what I needed to do is I guess the best way and this has been going on for a while where I haven't been exactly contented to just focus so I know I'm not the only one I've been getting texts from several friends about how they just aren't focusing how they want to do other things how they'd rather just sit and loaf around and vegetate and I'm not normally that sort of person normally I'd love to keep busy love to do a thousand and one things and I don't know what's going on I've just been so scatterbrained and having a hard time focusing unless it's absolutely 110% pleasure based that I'm doing something. So it's a problem I have to overcome because when I'm not even wanting to read Yaoi that means something bad has happened and this is not, mm, this is not how I normally operate. So that has been my major hiccup. Thank goodness I have pre-recorded quite a few Yaois because I have like five I have to review and I've read them and I'm just staring at them going, I need to record that. Ooh, look, something shiny. And that's literally been my life for the last like two weeks. And even right now, I keep clicking back to them want to finish watching the movie I started a little bit ago. Or, oh wait, I want to go text a friend and see what they're doing so I can go out. Or, oh, so-and-so didn't know I hadn't moved so I need to text them so we can hang back out again. And I'm just all over the place. I need to sit down and center and focus and breathe in. I think this weekend me going to go hang out with friends is maybe a good idea and spending a few hours away from the house so I can have 110% downtime to really relax and maybe relax, like get that moment of not necessarily tranquility, but stupid young people angst out of my system so I feel better about the whole situation and maybe can focus better. Who knows, maybe it's just a whole bunch of male frustration pent up and I need to find a little bit of relief, but I really doubt that's it. I don't know. Normally, if I read Yowies, though, it helps. But I haven't been in the mood. Maybe I should start a TV series. <laughs> maybe I should distract myself with more TV. Hmm. I don't know. What have you guys been avoiding doing? Let me know in the comments below. I mean, I need to want to make my comment section a dialogue. I actually wanted to start talking to you guys, not necessarily just through text, but also through my comment section below. And, I mean, we're all human. We all are trying to avoid some sort of responsibility. Oh, my hair has a pretty curl in it. That's actually really kind of cute. Um, so, what character should I cosplay next as? I've been really debating. I have a Seal Phantom Hive cosplay. I've never really debuted out in the public. There are a few pictures of me having worn it for Halloween a few years back, but I never actually did it the way I intended to have it. I have a Krona cosplay I can quickly whip up now that I have the base dress for it. Um, so I could do that and review some sort of doujin from Soul Eater or from Black Butler. Um, I have my Maleficent cosplay that I never actually really wore for Halloween all for too long because of how bad the rain got out here. Um, the head's right back there with the horns and it's like, it looks really cool finished. So maybe I'll do some sort of review working something in like that. Maybe I can find a doujin or something and order it and have it sent here. But yeah, I mean, I really don't know what's going on with me. I have like four shirts pinned and cut out and I have to get something made for this Friday and I have to start pre-recording my videos for December, like, next week. So I'm going to have to focus and get a lot of things pre-recorded for this month so I can be focused for next month and get motivated and done. So that way, when I go to school for three months, hopefully I can have 12 whims pre-recorded, 12 Yaoi reviews, and I'll have to record Monday vlogs and upload everything in advance and get it done so I don't have to worry about it. Oh, but the problem is, is I just want to sloth around my house and just hang around and move very slowly. 
mean, even right now, I'm like super thirsty and I don't want to get up to get water. And my lips, it's always, they're always chapped for a review, uh, for a vlog. And I don't know why. Uh, I think it's the fact that the day of vlogs, I just don't want to move. I don't want to see people. I want to pretend the world doesn't exist out my window. And like bundle up in a ball and just forget everything that happened the previous weekend, even if it was a good weekend. Uh, and that's pretty much what I did this past weekend, was just hide in the house and pretend the world didn't exist. So, yeah. My cell towers went down for my phone for Saturday and most of Sunday, which really sucked. I mean, it was mortifying and horrific. Uh, I'm doing Christmas shopping already. I mean, I... Yeah, work's slowly sucking up my soul and killing me. So that's making me very excited to go to actual school. I can't wait for school. It's so exciting and so far away. Um, the other thing that I am really excited about is getting to see some friends over Christmas break, which I'm trying to remember if they're coming, they finished the 16th or if they're coming into town on the 16th or somewhere around there. Um, you know who you are, Miss Person Who Lives Out of State now, and I want to see, and not just talk through text or telephone. I like this awkward pointing thing. Mm. I don't know. I just feel really random today. Not much has really happened in my life. I've trashed my room, cleaned it up like four or five times. It doesn't look very clean based upon the table in the background, but it is what it is, and that's just the way I am at the moment. It is organized, and it is organized chaos. Um, up there, I think, if I look, bend out of the way. Maleficent. Maleficent. Uh, hammer. Uh, more Maleficent extra fabric. Domo. Probably makeup removing wipes. Or cotton balls, it could be either. Fabric. Sewing. And then mangas. And... Mm -hmm. Excess fabric. That's the pink thing, if I could point right there. That's more fabric. Um, it looks unorganized, but I guarantee you it is. And it's easy enough for me to box up for when I actually leave again. Or get ready to leave, for sure. Um, we have our names in for four different houses right now. So, fingers crossed. Some of them are very, very cool. And locale is very, very amazing and awesome. So far... We don't have to get rid of any of the pets, which makes everybody super duper happy. Um, which, yes, I'm excited. Regardless of wherever we move, I'm going to have a 10 to 15 to 30 minute commute somewhere in that window that's in ideal traffic. Otherwise, I know it's going to be the reality of an hour commute if I go during peak times anywhere. But I have a cool location if we get some of those places and I'll have to show you guys around and get a small vlogging camera, not just my big one that I use for all the rest of my videos. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Remember, leave the comment down below letting me know what you've been avoiding. I'd really love to know, make my comment section into a dialogue. Um, so yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.